happy people i'm back with another video and today i'm bringing you all another bath and body works hack video um seemed like you all really liked the other hack that i did so i wanted to bring you another one and in that video i mentioned that i wanted to repurpose or show you all how i repurpose my bath and body works candles um so i have a few candles that i've already cleaned out um let me know if you all want to see a video of me cleaning out my bath and body works candles prepping them to be reused for other things um but yeah um i have a couple of unique different ways of how to repurpose your bath and body work candles something outside of just the standard cotton rounds and q-tips and things like that so let me hop right on into this i have one two three i have four different ways that you can repurpose your old bath and body works candles. okay so the first way you could repurpose your old bath and body works candles is literally just using it for your makeup brushes i'm sure a lot of people already do this but um i just want to show you all an example of what that looks like so in here i have all of like my face brushes my eyeshadow brushes um foundation highlight all of those different types of brushes stippling brush um, flat top kabuki brushes all those different type of brushes you name it it's in here so and then i also keep like my eyeshadow primer in here which i'm not sure why that's in here but um yeah so you can just keep all your different makeup brushes in here it's nice it's cute it's a nice clear jar so it looks nice and pretty and put together um you can also put like different type of pebbles or maybe different colored rocks in here um as another way to um make it look pretty and match the decor that might be in the room that you're displaying it in so yeah i actually keep this in my bathroom closet so it's not out on display um but you could definitely like jazz it up and make it cute if you wanted to by adding those different rocks and such at the bottom so that's one way to repurpose your bad old bath and body work candles the second way that i repurpose my bath and body work candles is by putting my um uh, surplus um lippies in there so you could put your different lip products inside of one of these and so i have everything from like lip gloss as you can see to different lipsticks i got my nyx here i have like some revlon matte lipsticks um and then this is just like a facial um cleansing pad that i use and just this is like all of my excess lip products though so whenever i run out of what i'm currently using this is what i have on standby to what i want to pull out and use next so this is kind of like my backup lippies and so i keep this in my bathroom closet as well but this is just another way to repurpose your bath and bodywear candle the third way that I repurpose it, which is probably one of the coolest ways that I repurpose it, is, is for my daily skincare routine. So everything that I use for my daily skincare is actually in this container. And in particular, I chose the yellow candle. I think this was the honeybee candle that I finished off a few years back. So I really like the color of the jar. So um, I repurposed it for my um, daily skincare routine. And actually, while I'm at it, um, someone actually wanted to see me talk about the products that I use in my daily skincare routine. So I'm going to go ahead and kind of go over those items with you all here. So typically on a day to day basis, y'all, I really only use a washcloth and water to wipe my face off. But sometimes if I want to get give my face a nice, uh, a nice cleanse, then I'll go ahead and use the items that's in this container here. So I have my facial pad here that I use to just kind of like scrub my face. I have a lip scrub that I use. I got this from um, Shop Miss A. It was only a buck. Um, this is my Garnier. Um, pore perfecting can of be um cleanse exfoliating mags i like what the one thing i like about this product is that you can use it in three different ways so it's a cleanser it's the exfoliating and then it's also a mask i've used it as all three ways and i really like this stuff for keeping clear skin so i keep that in there i also keep just some things to um, cleanse my skin like different pore pickers and things like that i have my um, makeup sponge here which is what i use to wipe my face and take off my makeup a lip scrub um a jelly face mask here i have my garnier pore perfecting serum cream this stuff is really good too it's from the same line as my facial cleanser but um i also keep that in there it works well i keep a lip oil in here for after i um, exfoliate my lips i also keep a daily highlighter in here this is from elf i really like using this just to add a little bit of glow to my face i also keep here this is just a um it's just like a roll on um skincare item from elf where if you have like a zit or something like that you can just roll it on your face and it's supposed to help get rid of it and then the last couple of items i have in here is just a, another lip scrub and then i also have a um eyelash glue pen type thing which you just take the lid off it's like felt tip 
so when I just need to throw some quick lashes on for the day I normally reach for this pen but yeah I actually keep all of those items in here in this tiny thing here oh I didn't mention this either so I also have an intense erase eye serum so that's another thing here so I'm gonna go ahead and put I'm gonna speed through be putting all these items back in here so you can see how much it actually fits So yeah, this is like my daily skincare routine when I'm ready to do some self pampering and self care. I keep all of that in an old Bath and Body Works candle, y'all. Yeah, I know. That's a good hack. You're welcome. You're welcome. Okay. Those are the four different ways that I repurpose my Bath and Body Works candles. Let me know if you all like this video and let me know if you want to see a part two. So I do have more ways that I repurpose my old candles. So let me know if you all want to see that down in the comments below. Let me know if you all want to see hacks for any other of my Bath and Body Works items that I use. So I do have a hack for how I take my full size fine fragrance mist, like the ones that don't have the twist off lid, how I actually am able to put these inside of a travel size container. Let me know if you all want to see that hack. Um, and then I also have ways that I repurpose some of my containers for like my body creams and body butters and things like that. So if that's something you all want to see, let me know. Maybe I can make this a series on my channel where I call it like bath and body work hacks. Oh, and also too, I have hacks for how to go through your products a little bit quicker because I know I'm not the only one that has a big collection. So I can also show you how to go through your products a little bit quicker while also still getting full use out of them. So yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this video. I do upload every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Saturdays in particular are my Bath and Body Works videos. So if you all like what you saw here, definitely stick around. Join the happy family. I'd love to have you. And as always, you guys, leave some love in the comments down below and I'll see you in my next video. I hope you all have a wonderful, awesome, spectacular day. Bye!